you guys seem to enjoy the last machine session that I did. So this time I'm doing another session, making beats all using machine. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do or how long this video is gonna be. These sessions will just be me creating. I'm not putting a time limit on it, I'm not gonna rush it, maybe 10 minutes, 20, 30, 40, maybe a whole hour, I do not know. I appreciate all you guys that tuned in to that last video, it was great. It was great to do that and also it helped me create content in a way that I didn't feel like I was rushed or had to put so much into it where I couldn't take the time to focus on the music. That is what this is all about. It's all about the music. I have samples that I downloaded from Tracklib. I don't even know if I'm gonna start with that. I might just do a little warm up. If I delete a beat, you probably will see it in this video. So you know that I delete stuff too. And I'm debating on whether I'm gonna film this with the Canon R8 or if I'm gonna use my Pocket 3 from DJI, which is right here. But when I recorded with this, it made it a hassle to sync the music up. I didn't have that problem when I used my main camera, so I'm probably gonna use my main camera just to make it easier on myself, but the quality should still be great because this camera has awesome quality. I'm not gonna hold you guys up anymore. If you have any questions, have anything you want me to do, like I'm thinking about having a Nexus session because I see that that's still one of my most popular videos the ones where i talk about nexus still get a lot of views regularly so i may do a machine and nexus session i also have the new logic pro 11 update i think i'm going to do a session using that and these longer videos would just be a session i may go into specific features and do individual videos but i'm enjoying this just being creative um, if you guys are interested in any of the things that I'm using, just ask. I may show the screen. If you guys think that'll be beneficial, let me know as well. So that way I can make sure I do it in the future. I appreciate you guys tuning in. I have the complete control MK2 right here. I know I have the MK3, but it does not work with machine yet. So with this machine session, I'm using this right now and I still had a machine dynamo hooked up. So I'm gonna use that. I'm excited to see what we come up with. This has been a very, very hectic week for me. So. I haven't really had the time to make nothing, so let's go ahead and get started.
Go check that out. Hopefully you enjoyed the video.